Welcome back to a brand new video. Now, this video is hopefully going to go really well. It's either going to go one or two ways. It's going to look really rubbish and I'm going to have to redo it, or it's going to look amazing and it's going to be one of the first I've ever seen done to a car. So, what it is, is actually glow in the dark paint and I'm hopefully going to be spraying the brake calipers in this. Now, in the daytime, it should look like that. And then at night, it should glow in the dark. I won't find that out until tonight, but I'm really hoping it actually works because it will look amazing. And like I said, it's something fun and quirky that you don't really see very often. I've never ever seen anyone with glow in the dark brake calipers. So that's the main focus of today's video. But first things first, I ordered this off eBay. Now what this is, is literally, it goes over your hazard button in the Corsa C. So that, will stick on there and then you stick a voxel badge in the model i know i know it was like two pounds before you go before you go crazy but it'll just make it a lot better instead of like a boring burgundy colored button so we're going to put that on now give it a quick clean and see what it looks like Okay, so this is before. So it's a little bit fiddly trying to get the sticker to actually stick down in the little gaps, but here's what it looks like. So it's just something small that anyone can do. So moving on to the brake calipers. Now I'm pretty sure these have never been cleaned ever. So we're gonna have to take the wheel, jack the car up, take the wheel off, give these a proper, proper good clean first things first i'm going to move the cars around in case i need to nip to halfords and get any brake cleaner or anything like that but we're gonna to have to give these a really good sand down hopefully i've got enough in the tin for um both calipers if not like i said i'm gonna to have to fight halfords and get some more spray let's give it a go and see what happens So before I carry on, I know a lot of you guys have said it in the comments, this car is gonna get a full mechanical check. I'm gonna do an oil change, change the brake disc, change the brake calipers. Um, that is to come. Uh, I'm just waiting for a bit more time off work. I know I've got this weekend off, but I really wanted to get this video out because I think it's gonna be pretty cool. But yeah, brake calipers aren't actually in as, as worse a shape as I thought. Gonna give them a clean, and then we might just go for it, mask it all off, and then just give it a spray. So I tried to give it a coat 
and it pretty much, I, I went out and got some primer because it's just going to be easier using primer so the, the yellow can come through a lot more. So I'm just going to mask it off again, give it some primer. So I'm going to leave that for about five to ten minutes and give it one more and then we're going to spray it yellow. So while we're waiting for that to dry, for those of you that have seen my sun strip, I just stick a bombed it. <laughs> and now, because Courtney has her sun strip, she's sat here, <laughs> stick a bomb in her sun strip. <laughs> it's going to look really good. Help me. What have you got? I can't feel them with my nails. Oh, look at the Gucci one. Oh, like, Gooch. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> okay, so it's had two coats of primer. Hopefully, this goes on really nicely. And hopefully we don't need another can because they're only they're only small but we'll we'll just see how it goes okay it's a lot better than before we use the primer i'm not going to bother doing the back here just because i've not got much paint and i don't want to waste it we'll see how it goes second coat looks pretty good i'll probably give it one more coat after that uh, and then we'll move on to the other one Okay, third and final coat. Just gonna give it a quick one over, just to make sure it's decently thick. Now I know this is not gonna be perfect, but hopefully it glows in the dark. So I'm gonna put the wheel back on, leave that, and then go do the other side. Oh no! My bags have flown down the driveway. Okay, so hopefully it ends up actually being a glow-in-the-dark spray. I know from here you can't really see it much because the wheels are like very thick spokes, but it is noticeable. I think it looks really good, whether it glows in the dark or not. The yellow and the black with the grey paint. Ah, oh, looks amazing. Okay, let's get the next one done. Okay, so exact same process as the other one. Clean it off with some cleaner. You could even use paint thinners for this. Just something that's really strong to get all the, just like surface dirt off really. And then just give it a wipe down with a microfiber. Do that a couple of times, just to make sure you've got all the, all the dirt off. How's it going in here? Yeah, oh my god. I don't think I want these ones, but I wish I'd have kind of put paper on it. Do you know what? That looks really good. Do you like it? Yeah, but I'm running out of good stickers. I've stuck all the good ones out first. What's wrong with that one? That's cool. I don't know. <laughs> no, I really do. I think it looks really good. Look, there's a dollar for poo. <laughs> <laughs> they're cool man so they're finished i'm not sure how they're gonna actually glow in the dark or even if they're gonna glow in the dark but i just gave them three coats of each on top of the primer and even if they don't glow in the dark i think they do look really really good i'm not sure how it's going to come across on camera but they, they, they look really really good they're really bright yellow how's your uh how's your sunstrip now oh that's cool i like that but yeah we'll wait for tonight i'm gonna put the wheel back on and just I'm, I'm really hoping that they at least just look like they're glowing a bit in the dark because that would just be so unique and cool and like i said before i'm not sure how long the paint is actually gonna last on these because i don't think it's made for like brake calipers and stuff like that but fingers crossed they glow in the dark at least and then at least it's it, at least it's been worth it so i'm going to put the wheel back on and then we're going to get a few clips of what it looks like tonight so i'm going to move the car into the garage i'm not too sure if they're going to light up but we'll have a see. It's pretty it's pretty dark in there, so we'll see if they light up. If not, I'll come out and I'll bring the car back out onto the driveway tonight. And uh, hopefully, hopefully, they glow in the dark. While we're waiting for the light to turn off, we're gonna just shine the torch 
shine our torches on the calipers and hopefully it like lights up the like ultraviolet light in it and as soon as that goes off we'll see if they actually glow in the dark right you ready go on your phone and then turn your light off you ready three two one oh my god they actually glow in the dark no way no way oh my gosh they actually glow in the dark that is insane and do you know when do you know when it's like a summer's day and they've been lit up for the whole day yeah and then they go in the dark oh my god look at them they actually glow in the dark. Didn't oh, think it'd actually yeah. work. <laughs> that is amazing. That's like, I might even do that to the VXR. Oh, they're so sick. Caught. Do you want to do me a favor? Yep. <laughs> do you want to move the VXR? You didn't even know what I was going to say. You just saw the VXR keys. So who actually wants to see a full video of Courtney driving the VXR. She's never drove any car except from this one. She had a little go in that one, but she's never drove a car with a clutch like the VXR. It's very stiff clutch. How's the clutch? I'm not on it yet. Press the clutch down. Okay, I'm on. How's, how much stiff is it compared to yours? Yeah, I'll give it that way to the Right, don't stall. So yeah, comment down below if you want to see Courtney do a full like video on driving the VXR. I think that would be a really good idea. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna bring this car out, leave it on the driveway, and then I'll come back out tonight and see how good the calipers are. Now, I actually cannot believe they generally glow in the dark. Like, I wasn't really, I know, I know the spray says they glow in the dark, but I just kind of wasn't expecting it to be as good as it is. I'll come back out tonight once it's dark, and hopefully we can get a better shot of how it looks like when it's actually glowing in the dark, but it really does look amazing. I'm gonna get some shots of how it looks in the daytime, and then we'll come back out and get some more shots later. Both cars are locked. And we'll pick the video up when it gets a bit darker outside. So the car's in the garage now, literally in pitch black, and it, it's clearly glowing in the dark. It's absolutely, I didn't actually think it'd work. It's crazy. So yeah, it's just something unique. Some people will probably think it's pathetic, but either way, in the, in the light, and in the daytime they're yellow anyway it's just an extra cool thing at night that happens so some people like it some people hate it but i just thought it was something different so i'm going to go ahead and end the video here in the dark cold garage and yeah if you did enjoy please remember to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you all in the next one peace